Welcome to the show, how you doing? It's me, Mr. Gibbs, and today we are doing a how to train your monster. We're here in Onet. It's this beautiful little town. You've probably seen it from Smash. And we're going to train our lovely little Axe Man. Look at him, he's so tiny. Axe Man, Axe Head. He's got different names, but one thing's for sure. He's way too little to do anything. We're gonna train him up and we're gonna make him fight different guys. And he's gonna get bigger, new moves and new limbs maybe. I don't know, we're gonna stretch him out and see what he can do. Also, he's gonna fight big guys like that. <laughs> like I think that's that's uh, supersonic.exe. I'm not sure if he can even die, but we're gonna go ahead and train him up and see if he can kill him. Are you ready, Axe Man? I like him like this. I don't know if I want him to grow up. So we're gonna go ahead and put down somebody to fight. But first, I kind of want to go run into the road and play in traffic. Now the cars, <laughs> the cars they hit you and they send you flying up. Um, and then they just spin off in the distance. So maybe we'll we'll switch things up and make them fight in the road uh, <laughs> Every once in a while. I think that would be a good twist. Who's gonna be his first victim? Let's find out I think this is an excellent place to start. He's terrifying to look at. This is Tall Toad, a teenager toad. He kind of looks like he'd be a teenager. He also looks like he's about to rap or something. Get over it. This is what he looks like now. And also, here's a bunch more of them. I'm gonna put down a ton of them because they're not very strong. Okay, Axe Man, Axe Head, whatever your name is, you're gonna have to kill these toads, all right? They've done nothing wrong. They're upstanding citizens. You just got, it's, it's what you have to do. Three, two, one, release. Release! He threw sharks at him and he killed them all. He ki and then he killed me with the shark move. I forgot that he throws sharks. It seems like he's got this under control, guys. That only means, you know, one thing. We've gotta, we've gotta make him bigger. He was making a run for traffic. Don't try and throw yourself in front of a car, all right? This is fun, you, en you enjoy this. First level up here, I mean, obviously, we got, he's gotta be a little bit bigger. Um, and there we go. Okay, wow, he's really grown up. He seems a little bit stretched. His arms are longer, his face is, is, is wider. He's perfect, in perfect shape to, I I guess throw sharks at people because that's what he does. Let's get him a new victim. Oh, look at these. Oh my God. They're all oh, the blood. Oh, their arms. They're this is horrible. This is horrible. I, it's just terrible to look at. So I'm going to put something in front of it. What about an attack helicopter? What is, where's, um, okay. This might not be the move, but I'm going to do it. Okay. He's, I see what he's doing. He's trying to just get a, the, they're from Australia. So they're trying to, <laughs> they're trying to see everything, uh, properly. Okay. All right. I can't even see the helicopter. Three, two, one, go. Okay. Helicopter. Yeah. Get in there. Helicopter. All right. The helicopter's shooting at him. The, sh the helicopter's blowing up. Oh my God. He got him. That's excellent. Good job, Axe Man. He took a hit, though. He took a few thousand um, uh, away uh, from his health, the, the helicopter did. But overall, you know, he's still standing strong. He is making his way into traffic. Maybe he's trying to catch a taxi. We're about to find out what will happen when he gets hit by a car. Oh my God. Oh my God. Are you okay? He's getting, he's trapped. He's getting hit by the pink car. It's his new, it's your new enemy. Oh God, they're forming into some kind of supercar. They're, you know, it's like some kind of car Beyblade going on here. They're trying to get him. Come on, come on out of there. Oh, and now they're all lumped up together because I messed up the timing on them. Wait, are they gonna keep coming out of there like that? Oh yeah, they are. They're, they go back and forth like that. Hold on, let me grab one. All right, well, now that the car problem's sorted out. Hey, no, no, no tailgating. There we go, all right. Okay, now that the car problem is solved, we can get back to the, you know, the pressing matters at hand, which is you need to get um, leveled up. I think that maybe uh, rotating his hands up so he can use those, yes. I I think that, you know, he's been too shy. He's only been using his shark moves. Maybe if he had the ability to hug them, things would go differently. I like this. He seems much more approachable now, you know? It's like, uh, it's like you kind of just want to run up and hug him now. And maybe we can make his axe face a little bit more, you know, axy. Aha, okay, it's his very top spine, spine 004. You can actually give him a nose. Look, he's got a nose. You didn't think that he needed a nose, but he did. That's what he needed. You can't see his eyes unless you're looking at him straight on, which could be bad for his peripheral vision, but we're gonna have to see how it affects him in battle. Okay, let's get his next person here. What about Insanity plus Spaghetti Shrek? I don't know why his name is Spaghetti Shrek. Kate, who's that? Oh God. Oh, that's terrifying. Okay, that's perfect. Now with a nose, Axe Man will be able to smell and that's good. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> Okay, he got the shark move again. I'm dead already. 
He's getting kicked and he's flying away, but he killed them all. And I think I saw a bit of a peck in there, like a nose move, you know? I think he learned a new move, and that is peck with his nose. Do you see? Do you see the things that I do for my creations? Wow, he actually almost died. Wow, that's terrible. Hey, stop running into traffic, guy. You're gonna cause problems again. Um, I don't know. Did the nose help him? Did it, did it hurt him? I don't know. It's hard to say. We need to run more tests. But first, we've got to level him up. Okay, here we go. He's healed up and he's also taller now. Did you notice? He's looking good. Uh, I'm just trying to think, what does he need, you know? He could have bigger wings. Yeah, maybe we need those to be longer. Aha, here we go. Big, long, pointy wings. That's the left one. There we go. That's what was missing. Boom, okay, that's good. If only there weren't so many holes in them, maybe he could fly. We're gonna get you flying in no time, buddy. Look at him, he's nodding. He says, yes, this is good for me. Maybe your ax head needs to be taller. Ah, whoa, that's pretty tall. Okay, hold on. Right about there. Yeah. Now your head's just kind of bigger, which is good for everybody. There we go. That's good. Bigger eyes, bigger nose, bigger wings. Everything a man needs to smell. Here we go. What's next? It's Train Eater, I think. Yeah, let's do that. Why not? He's got a mouthful of toads and he's ready to kill. Okay, here we go. And it's working. My god mode is working. I am able to witness this. He is beating up the sausage and the sausage is dead. He didn't even get to him. I'm gonna put another one down. There we go. Sausage number two. You thought number one was hard? Just wait. Okay, throw, you might want to do your shark move. Yeah, there you go. Beat him with the axe. Yeah, there you go. He's hacking at him, guys. Do you see the blood squirting out? It's really, oh, it's shooting blood everywhere. Oh God, is the ax man gonna be able to do it? Oh, he's got plenty of health. The train eater does not. Let me get back into my camera here. He killed him, he axed him, and he probably couldn't have done that if not for his big ax head. Why am I bleeding? Am I, is this me? Yeah, I'm because I'm in God mode, so everything's fine when you're in God mode. Remember that. If you're gonna play in traffic, make sure you turn on your God mode first, kids. Now, don't play in traffic. Uh, <laughs> uh, let's go ahead and bring out another opponent. But first, actually, I think we need to make you stronger. And by stronger, I mean taller, and therefore more handsome. Um, yes, this is good. This is very good. We're gonna put down a guy for you to kill now. Um, and now that your axe head is bigger, you're really reaching your full potential. I think we need to step it up into somebody stronger. Is this guy really strong? Oh yeah, he's really strong. He's about as strong as you are. Um, okay, so that's gonna be perfect. I'm gonna go ahead and get up here on this shelf. I feel like this is a good shelf. Three, two, one, go. Okay. It's, it's the Axeman versus the Wendigo. Wendigo, I don't know. I still don't know how to pronounce it. <laughs> Every way I say it, people say I say it wrong. Okay, it's working. He's getting him. He's getting him. Oh, he is definitely winning this fight. I'm getting pushed off the edge uh, by the rumbling. There's a lot of effects being popped off right now, but, the, but he, oh, wait, wait. He's killing the mystical deer man. He's killing the guy. Wait, don't run, don't run. Where are you going? Kill him. Get him with the shark, and he finishes him off with the head move. Look at him strut around. Doesn't he just, don't you just want to be this guy's friend? All right, it's time for a, this showdown here between big bad Sonic guy and the Axe Man. Now, I'm pretty sure Sonic can't die. I don't know this for sure, though. It's never, just because he hasn't died doesn't mean he can't die. You know, I haven't died yet, but does that mean I can't die? I don't, I sure hope not. You know, we need some cheerleaders. This, we're on this little field here. It's weird because it looks like it should be a soccer field, but then it has like, like baseball, uh, bases. It's, it's, it's really weird. Uh, but okay, we're, <laughs> we're gonna put down some cheerleaders. Yep, here's the cheerleading gang. This is it. You, you thought the Dallas, uh, cheer squad was good? Well, now you've seen it all. It's the cheerleading squad that everybody's talking about. It's the Bean Team. Bean, Bean, that doesn't really rhyme, does it? Um, it's the Bean Cheerleading Squad. Get over it, all right? Um, okay, here we go. This is really good. This is gonna be a great fight. I'm really excited to see it all play out, you know? Being with you from the very beginning, Axe Man Head guy, it's just, it's an honor, I must say. It is an honor. Okay, um, I actually wanna kinda get an angle at this so that I can continue to watch the cheerleaders. Guys, uh, how could I forget? There's one essential thing that is missing here. I've gotta make him gold. There we go, he's gold now and therefore stronger. Even though gold isn't a very, uh, you know, uh, strong metal, it's worth a lot, which means it is powerful. Okay, here we go. I want Want a nice clean fight you guys you guys are both yellow let's do this by the book three two one kill each other 
Oh, they're killing the beans. Oh my god, they found a common enemy. <laughs> oh lord. Okay, but now they're fighting each other. They've thrown that aside. Uh, it was once the enemy of my enemy is my friend, but now it is just you are my enemy, friend. Um, <laughs> okay, wait, are they fighting or are they... You guys gonna do this or not? Sonic keeps, like, throwing his hand aside like something's about to happen. Okay, now he's leaping into action. They are now fighting. Sharks are flying. The Axeman is getting axed. Oh, no. Oh, he killed him. And how much health does he have left? All of it. Well, I think that just goes to show you stuff. He can't actually die. <laughs>